Hello friends, today we are going to make a fraction strips using just paper. A fraction strip is a great tool to show how many unit fractions will fit into a whole. Take an A4 size thick paper and mark horizontal lines on it. Divide this paper into 10 equal parts. Here you can see the first part with mark 1 on it. The second part can be divided into two equal parts and the third part can be divided into three equal parts and so on. After marking the horizontal and vertical lines on the paper, you can cut the paper on those lines so that each piece of the paper is different. Now make a rectangular frame to fit all the pieces of the paper strips. If you place the longest yellow paper strip in the rectangular frame, then it represents the whole part. Now take two half strips and place them just below the single strip. Here you can see that if you can add two halves, you will get one whole strip. This means the addition of the two halves is one whole. Now take three strips and place them below the two half strips. You will see that if you add three one third strips again, you will get one whole strip. Similarly, if you add four pieces of small strips, you will get one whole strip and so on. When looking at this, one thing we should keep in mind is that we are looking at the relationship between the whole and its parts. Now, in this case, we are talking about the relationship between this whole number on the top and all their fraction underneath. If you got strip up along the way, keep in mind that we are looking at how many of these strips right here to fit this whole strip that will help you use this resource in the future to make sure that when you are looking at how many thirds or how many tenths to go into one hole. This is all about the relationship between this hole and these unit fractions. You can also make these fraction strips using wood or any soft material like foam rubber sheet so that they can be easy to handle. I hope you like this activity and you can make your own fraction strips and show to your friends and learn the concept of what is whole and its part which are the fractions. Thank you very much.